This is Greg with Best Choice Trailers. Today we're going to do a video demonstration for you of a Short Track 102 by 32 foot hydraulic dovetail dual tandem deck over. Trailer's 22,000 pound rated. We're going to walk around this particular trailer and show you a few of the features. Starting off, it's a 32 footer. That means it's going to be a 22 on the flat deck and then from the tail back will be 10 foot. I'm going to start out up front. There's a couple exclusive short track features that I like. Some of those we'll get to in a minute. First of all, they use I-beam construction on the neck and the mainframe. Several gussets along the trailer, you'll notice. They use all coated hardware. Of course, your neck is adjustable. You've got your safety set pins, breakaway cable. In the neck, there's going to be a spare tire mount. One nice feature about Short Tracks harnesses, they're fully sealed harnesses front to back. So you don't have your scotch lock connectors and whatnot like some of the other ones. Front full width toolbox with locking handle. Dual 12,000 pound spring assisted jacks. Notice the jacks are bolt on in case you need to replace one. All sealed beam LED lights are standard. Of course you got a pair of side steps. You'll notice on those steps they got uh, good traction so you don't slip and fall. There's eight D-rings standard on this particular trailer. They've got them front and back and in space about every 10 feet. They've also got a rub, rub rail for tie downs. And then they've got stake pockets and pipe spools that alternate approximately every 12 inches. Trailer's got a six inch channel outer rail. Okay, so you could also potentially tie to the rail and then you've also got the short track embossed reflector tape. Okay, here's one of the big things that I think find uh, you'll find that uh, set short track apart. They do um, an undercoating on their uh, under frame, and it's very durable. It holds up a lot better than powder coat or acrylic enamel to the salt that we see here in the north. They also do gusset bracing that's going to go from the I beam out to the outer rail. Bed cross members are 16 inch on center. Of course, all the hydraulics are contained within a toolbox. They use a buyer's box. Uh, it's got your standard T handle with a lock. You've got a DECA deep cycle marine battery and a power up, power down hydraulic pump. You've got a 20 foot remote cord, which will take you back to the tail or up toward your truck. Oil bath bearings are standard on this particular trailer. You've also got your Provider 235-80-16 10-ply radial tires. Slipper spring suspension standard. With the undercoating, it'll make uh, everything last a little bit longer. You also notice at the back pivot point, nice little detail, typical short track. They put a grease dirt on it. They use a little bit larger cylinders than most. These are five inch cylinders. Uh, I do dual cylinders on this particular unit. One other key thing that Short Track does that a lot of other ones don't, uh, they have a separate lockout uh, housing for this particular trailer. Right now, you'll notice that the uh, separate lockout housing right here is in the up position. That's because the cylinder's unlocked. Now, that separate lockout's going to get down whenever the cylinder does get locked out. Yeah, and they're five inch cylinders that they do, a little bit more substantial. And of course they tie into the bulkhead that you see here. Okay, and of course, again, everything's undercoated on the underside of the trailer. Here's your lockout handle. So you'd simply flip that handle to go from one side to the other. I'm gonna drop the tail down for you. It's a 10 foot tail. Got about three and a half foot of tread plate. Of course, they put some D-rings at the very back, and it's got your spring light bar. Another little detail they do, they take and put about two extra inches, so that that tail gets down to a little bit of nothing. Uh, very simple to bridge that gap. There's your spring light bar at the back. I'm going to step back so you can see. This particular unit will go a little bit above level, so you can get to... Uh, almost dock height level without having any major gaps. See deployment's pretty quick. Probably 15 to 20 second deployment you're ready to roll. Yeah, 
Again, whenever it gets to the up position, you would simply lash it shut. So you'd simply flip that over, lock it in place, and you're ready to go. Of course, the top coat on everything Shore Track is all powder coated. Everything's bead blasted, phosphate washed. Again, this is a 2015 Shore Track 102 by 32, 22,000 pound hydraulic dovetail trailer. If you have any questions, give us a ring 717 220 4220. This is Greg with Best Choice Trailers. Thanks for looking.